welcome to the capital smart city site general khalid said saab md national command authority foundation general anwar choudhry saab aslam malik saab group ceo capital smart city general najmul hasan saab our director health and education distinguished guests assalam alaikum i would welcome you on behalf of our chairman mr zahid rafiq and group ceo mr aslam malik our group uh, our chairman uh, is traveling he is abroad uh, he conveyed his many uh, congratulations to you and handing you over the allotment letter for 1000 canals of land as you know that habib rafiq private limited is not a new name in the market we have more than 65 years of track record now very briefly i will show you a few videos one first one is the profile of hrl and a later part a small little portion depict the capital smart city these are the project which we have completed habib rafiq private limited is a symbol of commitment distinction and professional excellence hrl has rapidly gained an unmatched reputation in civil mechanical and electrical engineering by consistently completing mega projects ahead of their schedule hrl has remained strong in the business for the last 60 years by entering into international markets hrl has evolved as company capable for undertaking several projects simultaneously without compromising its high standards quality and tenderness Thank you so much. Thank you. People ask us why have we selected this site? Malik Saab and his team was given the task to select a location of this project, which has water. Water is life, and it has the connectivity. And then third task given. to him and his team was that the land substantial land is available his team took 18 months to select this site we are very lucky and thanks to uh, malik aslam saab and his team for their dedication that this is the place where we have 750 acres of chahan dam there is a sil river passing through it right in the middle of our project we have 12 to 15 rain water harvesting check dams we have got the study done from naspa about the feasibility of this water and they said for half a million population it is good enough for more than 50 years it may sound very uh, you know less important but water is extremely important for us and now when we say that 5 minutes drive from islamabad international airport and that to on a player drive on m2 motorway so this again is 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 a, is a, is a big thing for us this year we are going to launch two more project 3000 very high end villas around 18 old pga standard signature golf course which our consultant say this golf course inshallah that is when it is going to be completed in next 3 years it's going to be one of the best in this whole region not only in pakistan and beside that another project is one capital high end 1780 apartments designed by our consultant from spain and the third one is the lamaer district we call it we have a beautiful piece of land which has three side water is a kind of is a non residential area is a high end boutique shops so let me very briefly show you a small little video clips of all these three project first the capital hills
It is not only that I call myself a smart city and it becomes smart city. There are certain criteria which you have fulfilled and then take that city to Singapore. After every five years there is an accreditation and then you ask them to come and visit and see if we qualify. Then we come, we appear on the map of smart cities of the globe. And inshallah, the same, uh, the, the same urban designer who has designed our city, they are designing three smart cities in India. And all three cities are stuck. It's only our smart city which is moving. Perhaps it is in the private sector. If it was in the public sector, I'm sure it would have been the same fate as the Indians have. So it's the private sector, so we're pushing it. And the determination, Balak Sahib and his team. So we are very proud. We are very happy. Let me uh, show you this part of the video. Please, one color. These are, uh, I was talking to you about Marla Hills. Just Rokna is the just a minute. In this, the, you see this, uh, uh, there's a mosque in between, and there is a water feature. Let me share a small little, uh, uh, you know, thing that how we uh, came to this conclusion. We saw a picture of Taj Mahal. Taj Mahal, white marble building, standing next to Yumna River and beautiful reflection in the river. We said, let's have a building, let's have a mosque, which, which should be central. Mosque and the religion is our center of gravity. So it, it should be in the center, it should have a lagoon alongside, and it gives a beautiful reflection in the water. The third project which we are going to launch is the La Mer. This is a non-residential high-end uh, area. It has La Mer means beach. If you have visited Dubai, I'm sure you must have gone and visited Namai. So name is borrowed from there, uh, but definitely the design. This is uh, designed from an Australian company. They have designed it. We have everything. We have expertise. We have will. We have financial resources. And hopefully, inshallah, we will do it. Thank you so much. Thank you.